guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another video today's video is a quick makeup look mainly focusing on the eye makeup look 10 minute eye makeup look literally only using three colors so you guys know with eyeshadow like you need so many things when i do my eyeshadow i use so many different palettes i could use three different palettes with one look but with this you only need one look i mean one eyeshadow palette and literally three colors so the colors that i used on this palette is this beautiful brown color and then this orangish for transition and then the brown was like for the depth and this was for the inside of my eye so you can achieve this literally under 10 minutes if you really need to leave and you can't spend too much time on your eyeshadow or you're feeling lazy but you still want to look good um yeah it's a three colored eyeshadow tutorial so um, I don't want to waste you guys time. Please do enjoy this video. I tried other makeup products that are new. I'm still going to do reviews for some of them. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. We have reached 2000 actually. I checked the other day. Thank you so much. And yeah, we're growing. Please do join our beautiful family. You do not want to miss the train. <laughs> you don't want to miss this one. So yeah, thank you so much you guys for tuning in to another one and I will see you guys in the next one. But without further ado, let's get into the tutorial. First things first, I'm going to go in with the Last Stain Finish Fix and Go Spray from Rimmel London. And I'm going to use that as my primer and just let that dry. And then I'm going to move on to the L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Matte Foundation. This is a full coverage foundation so it's literally perfect for a kind of look where you want the full coverage and a full glam. And I'm just going to blend it out with my foundation brush and then later on I'm going to blend it out with the beauty blender as it makes it more seamless. And then I'm going to move on to highlighting and contouring. So I'm going to go in first with the highlighter under my eyes, on the bridge of my nose, a little bit on my forehead, as well as my cupid's bone chin. So I'm firstly going in with a concealer that is more or less close to my skin tone and then I'm going to move on to a brighter concealer. This just helps so that it seamlessly blends into my skin and it doesn't also look very harsh. I'm also going to wet the beauty blend a little bit with the setting spray. This just helps so that it seamlessly blends out the concealer and the beauty blender is not dry. So try this trick you guys, it really really helps. As you guys can see, I didn't really um, put the concealer in a triangle shape. So I put a little bit in the corner of my eye as well as towards the outer corners. This helps to lift the face instead of dragging it down. And I'm just going to keep on blending it.
finally after blending the highlighting concealer i'm going to go in with my contouring concealer i will point out that this one is a little bit too dark for me but i tried to make it work by continuously blending it out and also not using too much product so the secret to blending a contour is to go in the upward direction so that you don't drag your face down and that way you actually lift your face up instead of um, dragging it downwards I'm then going to use a setting powder this is the Revlon banana powder and this is just going to help to make sure that the concealer does not move or shift and also crease finally we're going to move on to the lady of the moment which is the Huda Beauty Topaz Obsessions palette so this, this is the main focus of the video today I'm basically going to show you how you can create a quick makeup look using three shades literally three i'm not kidding i kid you not so i'm gonna go in with that orange color as that is the transition shade and that is the one that is usually very closest to your skin tone just to ensure that the eyeshadow is seamless And then I'm going to focus the brownish shade on the outer corners of my eye. This is just going to help to create depth and make it look um, really beautiful and seamless. And then finally I'm going to use that orange yellowish color in the middle or in just in the corners of my eye on top of the lid. And this is going to be kind of like the shimmery shade but it's not. It's more like a matte shade. And I, what I love about this eyeshadow is that you can literally rock it on a daily basis. It's not too much and it kind of goes with any outfit and any kind of look that you create. Finally, I'm going to go in with my Maybelline liquid eyeliner and I'm literally just creating a small line. It's not going to be anything dramatic. This is just to, so that it helps for the eyelashes to blend in where I place them. And finally, I'm going to go in with these Essence lashes. These are the Like a Boss eyelashes. Literally one of my favorites. The last time I wore them was during my graduation. So yeah, it's really, really beautiful. You can get them at your nearest Discam stores finally i'm gonna line my lips and i'm literally just using my eyebrow pencil because i couldn't find any of my brown liners and just line the corner the outer part of my lips and then i'm gonna go in with a matte lipstick Because I didn't want it to be a matte look, I decided to add a little bit of gloss on top. It's the Essence Shine Shine um, Lip Gloss. You can literally also get it also in Discam and it's just literally one of my favorites. And then I'm just going to blend it out with a different brush just so that I don't make the wand dirty. 
Okay, so we've come to the end of the video. I'm finally gonna set my makeup with the Lasting Finish Fix and Go spray from Rimmel London. Anyway, so we've come to the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. As you guys saw, I literally created this eye look quick and easy within less than 10 minutes with three simple colors from the Huda Beauty palette. This is the Topaz Obsessions palette and it looks like this. You can get it from Ox store online or in store. I put it in store and literally the only three colors I used you guys, I kid you not, was this, this and that. One, two, three. So yeah, get yourselves this kind of palette. You can literally achieve this look in under 10 minutes. Well, the eye look. Everything else did it take a bit of time. <laughs> So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and share this video with someone who maybe struggles with eyeshadow or wants some hacks on how to do their eyeshadow quicker, like, quick and out, okay? <laughs> anyway guys, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.